get into the groove, boy, you got to prove your love to me, yeah. Don't try and get me involved. Zoe doesn't want to be a part of Booktube anymore. Yeah, not just part of this singing thing. She says that she's over it. <laughs> she said reading stupid. Why would you say that? Okay, um, so it's midnight, and we've been watching some very inspiring booktube videos. And so now we want a tube. Or I do, at least. So he's drinking wine with a leopard print neck pillow. Oh, and I've got cold sores. Oh, yeah. What? <laughs> Does it? Um... So, I was tagged by Liz, and... Why are you looking at me? Look at the camera. Because you're looking at me. Read your book like you were doing a second ago. You're like, <laughs> she's staring at me. So, I'm like, <laughs> should I turn a little bit so I could look at the camera and at you? <laughs> Just talk. Okay. So, this is the finished, the book tag. Um, seriously, you're going to have to stop with the coughing. Um, this was created by Headless Books. Um, so here we go. Do you keep a list of the books you have read? I have stuff on Goodreads. And I tried doing a proper commonplace book this year. And, um, I think around... May? Something happened. And the pages are all blank after that. So, I really don't want to have to look over there. Because, <laughs> like, I look over... Why you close because now I'm not going to be like this. This is my ear. Oh. You know, but, like, you, you went... Okay. No, I should have. The commonplace thing. It's yeah. Good. I still have it. I could do it. Um, if you record stats, what stats do you record? I record if I read the book. And I do stars. But I think there's a rating question. Yes, that's the next one, so we'll go right to it. Do you give star ratings for books? And if so... What do you score books out of, and how do you come about this score? Very politely. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> um, like, five stars means, like, it was the most amazing thing ever. And because um, of my uh, pendulum swinging mania, I guess, um, the best thing ever happens a lot. So, um... If I really like something, I really like it. Um, in fact, today I gave five stars to Batman Kings of Fear with art by Kelly Jones. Five stars. It's really good. I wouldn't believe that. It's really good. And the Batman Universe podcast only gave it two. <gasps> because they don't like Kelly Jones. Really? And I'm very upset with them. And I wrote them and told them. Did you? Nice work there. Yeah. I am definitely now my mother. <laughs> um, I, I wrote a strongly worded comment. Tell them about Spongebob. <sighs> oh, okay. No, no, it wasn't Spongebob, was it? It was like... Um, Nickelodeon. Yeah, it was on Nickelodeon. I don't know. Um, okay, so my daughter was at my mom's when she was little and she was watching Nickelodeon. And... Um, there was this, like, joke about farts. I can't believe I said that. I feel dirty when <laughs> saying it. Um, but, like, it had, like, this kid, and it was, like, telling you what to do if you fart a bunch at school. And so, like, you put a dryer sheet in your pants. And then it had this animation of, like, a kid walking <laughs> down a row of uh, desks, and he was just like, toot 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 and like flowers were like drawn off and like kids were like oh 
yeah, that's great. It smells like clean laundry. <laughs> um, and my mom got so mad and was so offended that they said the F word that's on TV. Her huh? That's her, that's her F word. She wrote them a letter. <laughs> <laughs> and so he thinks it's hysterical. Um, let me see. Uh, oh, yeah. So five is amazing. Four is like, it was almost perfect, but there was just like one thing that wasn't, that made me do a four. Three is like, I read it and I'm glad I read it, but I'll probably forget everything I just read and I'll probably never read it again. Two is... Like, I read this book, and I hate myself so much for doing it. I really shouldn't have done that, but I did it. So, fucking here's two stars. And then, um, one star is like, if I read the book and finished the book, because I hated it so much as I was reading it that I wanted to finish it so I could talk about how much I hated it. Okay, I, um, I get really mad, yeah. Um, I don't know why I get mad. I don't know who I get mad at. But, like, there's a lot of shouting and stuff. Um, yeah. I try not to rate a book if I DNF it. Um, I don't know why. I don't know. Like, I think I get irritated when I see people on Goodreads, like, give something one star, and then the review is, um, I DNF'd it after 15 pages. Because that, that seems kind of weak. Um, like, for instance, like, right now I'm reading, um, Edgar Rice Burroughs' Pirates of Venus, and I'm almost done with it. But, um, the first, like two paragraphs were like the best two paragraphs I ever read in a book ever. Like, especially opening paragraphs. I was just like, Oh my gosh. And then it just started getting bogged down and bogged down. And then it took about a hundred pages to like crank up the action. And once it did, it's been like a nonstop roller coaster of adventure. You could quote me on that. <laughs> um, and I have like 50 pages left, I think. And um, it seems like the book's over. Like, I don't know how it could keep going. Um, so I guess we'll find out. Or I will at least. Um, do you review books? I try not to because um, I... A lot of my... Not views, but, like, opinions change. Like, there's a lot of times when um, I read a book and immediately go on Goodreads and give it a score. And then a couple days later, I'm like, ooh. And then I try to sneak in and rescore that book. But I'm sure everyone sees it again. And is like, oh, he's just being indecisive. And they're probably right. <sighs> um, and I... Yeah, I do. Oh, I don't score books that my friends wrote. Because I feel like that would look like just, what do you call it? Like a, Yeah, like a favorited kind of thing. Um, and then, what's the other... Like, I've written reviews for some things... Especially, like, the review... This isn't a review, though. Like, on the review for the Batman book I gave five stars to today, I said, okay, stop what you're doing right now and go get this. Like, seriously, stop what you're doing. And that was, like, my review. And that's not a review. That's me telling you to do something because I felt something was so good, but I'm not telling you why. Um, so, no, I don't... I have done reviews, um... But, like, I use Goodreads for me, so I know what I read and when I read it and if I liked it or not kind of thing. So, um, yeah. 
Uh, next question. Um, where do you put your finished books? Yeah. Did you guys hear her? Because she was being foul and unladylike. Yeah. Um, that's a very personal question. And I will answer it in song. <laughs> no, no. no. Um, I just put them anywhere. Um, if I'm going to do a video on them, I'll put them like on my desk or like on top of a stack of books. Oh, that awesome the cart has been a failure, a failure. <gasps> you said it you? first Mine's got all sorts on it. my little dog pulled my Celine book out of the cart and chewed it <laughs> because Zoe doesn't want to have to get up to get to the cart she wants the cart right next to the couch so she could reach over Zooming. and grab a book and you know who grabbed a book Mina and you know what she grabbed it with? Her fucking mouth. And now there's little fucking teeth marks. <laughs> and my beautiful Celine book that I got for my birthday. So, um, yeah, I just put them places. That was good. How do you pick your next book? Um, we were just talking about this because we just watched Liz's video. Mm -hmm. But um, Zoe's a mood reader. Massive. She'll, like... The other day she went like this to me. Such a woman. She's like, which one do I read? What should I read? And I'm like, um, I don't know, that one, I guess? Mm -hmm. I think I'm going to read this one. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, why the fuck did you even come over no, here? <laughs> she always does that, though. <laughs> Like, she keeps asking me what she should read after she finishes a book. And I'm like, oh, how about you read that Margarita and the Devil or whatever it's yeah. called. And she's like, and then starts reading some other fucking book. <laughs> so, yeah. My I opinion try. is pointless. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. I know I'm into video, hmm. but I try and move genres around a little bit. Yeah. You know, bit of horror, bit of... There's a lot of hand gestures going on right now. <laughs> bit of horror, bit of classics. Yeah. Yeah. I try and mix it up a bit. She tries to and mix I it up a bit. I also pick smaller books because they're the ones I can read with my eyes without falling asleep. Yeah. Audio books are pick big ones. Yeah, but you reason. all but but you always buy big books. Yeah, I do. And then you're like, I'll have to get this on Audible. Yeah, and I'm like, what the fuck are you doing? Like, why did you buy that book? Because I want the book. Yeah. Okay. So, Sorry. Um, since I got tagged in this, I'll, I'll answer the question now. Um, but I like to think that I put TBR stacks together and just read it down the list. I've got something. Oh, yeah? She just flipped me off. She put her hand inside her pants and pulled her hand out and flipped me off. And she's only like four glasses in, <laughs> so it's very strange. I'm really sick. I'm yeah, we're both ill. I'm self-medicating. Uh, um, but I am kind of mood reader, um, because I've read. I think I've read. I think I've read three other books since I started this, um, and then Zoe got me this awesome how to write. Um, tales of horror fantasy and science fiction obviously because she has a lot of faith in the writing i've already done <laughs> no, but, but look at this this guy's like hmm i'm gonna like i don't know if i'm handing it or getting it <laughs> but somehow or another this floppy disk is getting put into this <laughs> dos computer system um so it's a little dated but it's actually a lot of fun um the <laughs> articles in it or little snippets or like the ones that I've read so far have been really clever. Um, but that's not what we're here for. Um, but yeah, I, I don't, I mood it a bit. I think, um, do you have any other rituals for when you have finished a book? I don't think so. I think I, is that picture moving? Fuck, I thought I was falling face first into the computer. 
Where are vertigo? Oh my god, I totally thought I was falling. Tell them what you're looking at. Oh, the, um, on the fire stick, like if you don't watch it soon enough, it starts showing these pictures of scenery or some shit. And, um, it was out of the corner of my eye and I saw it moving and it was going this it's way. Okay. So I thought I was falling. I got really scared. Um... Like when you saw the giant spider. Oh, are we going to do this now? Because <laughs> um, apparently where Zoe comes from, the spiders are as big as... Re get ready for this. They're as big as mosses. <laughs> and um, they just run right across the floor like they own the place. Yeah, they do. Yeah. Um... So anyway, um, I, I'm trying to think. I'm sure I have some kind if of ritual. If Steve Partridge watches this, he'll tell you. They're huge. If Steve Partridge comes out of the weird little box he's been locked up in. Yeah, that's true. We yeah. He needs to get his act together because... He, mi he might have taken... A, yeah, he might have taken a vow of silence. <laughs> Although... Well, it is like modesty too. Yeah, yeah. Although he has been posting... Um, pictures of graffiti and hot dogs, I think. I can't remember. Um, so, no. I, I just rambled on. I guess I have no other rituals. This tag has made me feel like a stupid reader. Like, not I'm stupid because I read, but, like, I don't take enough of my reading. No, you just enjoy reading. I just fucking enjoy you reading. You don't yeah. Want to write stats about it? I'd rather write a book or write a story than write about someone else's story. Does that make sense? Uh, yeah. yeah. That's fair enough. Fair enough. So, um, who do I tag? I'm not sure who has done this and who hasn't. Um, so, I'll just go down. Market Richardson reads. Did he not make that tag up? No. Um, Amy at Dusty Bookshelf, I think it's from the Dusty Bookshelf, and I always yeah. say at, um, who else do we watch a lot? Oh, you know what? What about, um, let's do chapter and verse. What about James Chapin? Yeah, James. Yeah, do chapter and verse. Yeah, so there you go. Boom. Tagged. Uh, suck it. There it is. Um, I didn't say it. You've got to say it. Say what? I didn't say it loud enough. Say what loud enough? James, Chatham, and chapter and verse. I already said chapter and verse, and I said James. James Chatham. Okay, get in here. Do this. Tagged. God, this is awful. I should edit this, but I ain't gonna. <laughs> <laughs> so, okay. Until next time, everybody. Bye. Bye.